So Tiger Woods has just undergone his fifth ever back surgery. Now, it's no secret that Tiger's career has been riddled with injuries, and in this video we're going to talk about this latest back surgery, what it means for his career in terms of his future, does he have a future on tour, and when does it look like he will actually be returning to the PJ Tour, and when will he be able to compete and play golf again. So the first thing to note is that this surgery Tiger personally considered to be a fairly small surgery. He's obviously, his last surgery was this back fusion uh, back in 2017. It doesn't seem like that long ago, but almost four years ago now. And I mean, since then he's made one of the all-time greatest comebacks in sporting history. I don't think it's any secret that, you know, it's just been an incredible comeback and no one really predicted or expected just how good he could be again after all of his back issues. Um, Tiger, obviously the last, since, since kind of COVID-19 has come around, in the last year, he hasn't been playing very well. His swing speed's been a little bit down. His, you know, we've seen at certain events, it looks like he's been a little bit uncomfortable walking around the fairways, especially at some colder events. And he has also been reported that he's had some kind of pain shooting down his legs, some nerve pain there, which obviously is not very good. And if you've got that swinging a golf club, it is going to affect you. So this latest back surgery, what does it mean for Tiger's career? Well, he considered it a pretty small surgery and let's take a look at exactly what was going on. He did put out this statement and say to the PJ Tour, I look forward to begin training and focused on getting back out on tour. That was direct coming from him, the statement that was put out to the press. Um, you know, his last uh, event was obviously the PNC Championship where he played with his son Charlie which has got to actually be one of my all-time favorite golfing events watching that was amazing so he's obviously now tied on 82 tour wins as well with Sam Snead so he needs one more to be officially the most tour wins ever which I just can't see being beaten ever, not because players aren't good enough, because there's, I would say, more competition now, there's more better golfers, and, you know, the competition is just so fierce. Um, it does look like he is going to, unfortunately, miss uh, playing at Torrey Pines in the Farmers Insurance Open, and um, he's also going to miss the uh, event uh, the Genesis Invitational at Riviera Country Club, uh, which is the February the 18th to the 21st, which he is actually hosting that event. So he will be there, but he will not be playing in it, unfortunately. Um, we will, in later in this video, I will be telling you when it looks like he will be coming back to play, though, because that's quite interesting as well. Um, Rory McIlroy also answered a few questions about this and said that he had known for a while about this surgery and, you know, that it was a, that Tiger considered it a small procedure, but obviously that any time you're being cut into, um, it's, you know, not that small. Um, apparently Tiger was actually back on his feet the very next day, which is a really good sign, obviously. Um, and, you know, so there isn't too much to read into it. So what was the actual surgery doing? Well, it was a micro disectomy to remove a pressurized disc fragment that had been giving Tiger nerve pain for the last month or so. So I'm not a doctor. I'm not going to dive too much into that. But for Tiger, he considered it a fairly small procedure. Padre Carrington actually commented on this as well and said that obviously Tiger is still a very young man 
and that you know it's no secret that his his career ha he has been predisposed to a few injuries um he said that some weeks he doesn't look like he could be competitive but the weeks he's walking better he's obviously a big contender the reason tiger had this surgery other than the um nerve pain down his leg was also that he had concerns about decreasing swing speed he hadn't been swinging the golf club as fast and then obviously the pain as well kind of i guess pushed him into getting the surgery i think if it had just been decreasing swing speed but he had no pain obviously maybe that wouldn't have been the case but it is we do have some good news with this because Tiger has actually been back hitting out hitting balls on the golf course, which is a great thing. Um, again, Nota Begay said, I just exchanged text with him a little while ago and he's doing great. He's out on the course hitting golf balls. He wasn't ripping drivers. He was just getting a feel for the game after the surgery and seeing how everything is. Um, that's obviously a great sign if he's not just up walking around, but he's actually able to hit golf balls again. That's this early as well. That's, you know, a good sign for us that we're going to be getting Tiger returning to PJ Tour events very soon. He also said um, Tiger then released a statement after this and said, I look forward to begin training and I'm focused on getting back out on tour. Um, this was, you know, obviously such a great thing to hear and i think we're all looking forward to having him back so when does it look like tiger will be able to return back onto the pj tour well his aim is obviously to be back for the masters um it would be incredible if he could get back for that a lot of people are saying he will be back before that, possibly at the WGC, the World, Go World Golf Championship event in Florida. It would really be good if he could get back before the Masters and play some competitive golf because from the PNC Championship to the Masters, obviously that's a break of about four months or so. And, you know, without any competitive golf, plus a back surgery, so he wouldn't have been practicing as much you know, it would be very beneficial in his run up to the Masters if he could get back in some competitive golf. And I think that will probably be his aim as well. Maybe to play one or two events before the Masters would definitely be good. And it will be good to see him back out on the golf course as well. So guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you think. If you have any more information about Tiger Surgery, I'd love to hear it. Comment your thoughts down below. Let me know what other videos you guys want to see on my channel. I'm always open to ideas. I respond to all the comments down below, so I'd love to get your guys' opinions. Obviously, remember to like this video, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you next time, guys. As always, grip it and rip it.